it is hot fucking muggy sticky fucking hot and it's uh it's a school night so i thought i'm gonna have a beer because it's so fucking hot so let's get into a beer review hey guys welcome back to beer reviews with the beer sage like i said hot fucking stinking hot so i thought I'll get into a beer review, um, even though I shouldn't be, because it's uh, fucking Thursday. And yeah, usually do them on a Friday. But we're going to get into this one here, which is a little bit different. Look at that sucker there. Pacifico. So this is Cerveza. Cerveza. So Pacifico Clara. Uh, yeah, for those of you who um, are geographical nerds, geographical nerds, this is from the Sinaloa province in Mexico. Yeah, where the cartel is from. Uh, I can't tell if this is a Sinaloa cartel beer. I don't think it is. Apparently brewed for over a hundred years uh, by three German dudes who landed in Mexico and decided, fuck it, let's make some beer. Now, from what I read along, they said this is a fairly decent beer. Um, and you should put some, like a lime, in the neck of it. I mean, we don't fiddle faddle or dilly dally with fucking fruit in our beer. Um, I mean, uh, I don't. If you want to put fruit in your beer, then you fucking do it. But don't expect me to fucking do it here or do it for you. So we're gonna pop this off. So it's a, it's a, a scab. You've got to lift a scab off the top. It's a fucking classy beers. I mean you find a classy beer it's not a twist top. This is not a twist top. So I'm going to biff this into this uh, moderately chilled glass. I just put it in the fridge and just pulled it straight back out again so it's not moderately chilled at all. So let's have a look at it. And to be fair I couldn't put fruit in the uh, neck of this and then pour it in here could I? Could I? I want to give you guys a, a true representation of what this beer looks like. So there, there you go. It's a it's a, well, it's a very weak urine sort of colour, isn't it? Um, yeah, not mildly uh, carbonated, not massively carbonated. In fact, it looks like it might be a still, but it's not. It's got a little few bubbles coming off it. Bit of a sniff. It's got that um, Mexican beer smell, that. Uh, not so much a full-on bodied hop smell, but like a real light, light smell. And it smells sweet, like it's got a sweet smell to it. Jesus, I bloody dropped the bottle. Uh, yeah, it's got a sweet smell. Um, it is a, it's a 4.4, it's a 3.55, so it's a big, it's a big bottle. Um, yeah, let's have a taste. Mm, it's sweet. It is sweet. You could smell the sweetness straight away. Um, but it is sweet. It is. Uh, it has no bitterness whatsoever. There may be a slight bitterness at the back end there, but not a lot. It's very, very light. Uh, it's quite refreshing. And yeah, it, it, but the the sweetness is the thing that you'll you notice quite a bit. So I would assume that this one would cause a fucking stonking headache in the morning if you had too many of them. But it's it's all right. It's not too bad. Now these were. Um, from Liquorland in a six pack, in a six pack they were, and they, I think they were 16 bucks for a six pack, which isn't too bad, it's $36 a dozen. Uh, yeah, it's pretty, yeah, it's pretty expensive, but then it, these are 355 bottles, so 
you're getting an extra 25 mils per bottle uh, and over a dozen that adds up to I don't know maybe an extra bottle it's not a lot in fact it's bugger all isn't it yeah it's not even a, an extra cup of beer per six pack but anyway that's what you're looking for if you want to try it Pacifico Clara Cerveza which is Spanish as we all know for beer and uh, I learned a bit of Spanish a couple of years ago so yeah Cerveza Cerveza it is Spanish for beer uh, yeah La Cerveza del Pacifico means um, the beer of the Pacific yeah that's right I have no fucking idea if that's what it means but anyway there you go it does have an 18 plus on the side here so luckily uh, kids can't drink it there you go have a crack at Pacifico Clara get that at Liquor Land and uh, see what you think drop some comments down below if you think it's shit drop some comments down below if you think it's good like and subscribe I'll put the little bell up this time and um, yeah. here's another beer review from the Beer Sage.